On this video, I'm just gonna talk to you about how I'm gonna mount the small rig fluid head pretty much on any tripod. In this case, it's the Peak Design tripod with the ball head. And the reason why this would be cool is because now I can do panoramas on here. I can use this bottom piece right here as kind of like a bowl head to kind of move it around whatever direction I want. Then I can tighten it and then I can look here to kind of see if it's level. I can use it for if I'm doing any filming and I want to have like a nice fluid head as I'm panning or tilting. So it's just a really nice setup to have if you want to travel light and have a nice fluid head with you. So let's go ahead and talk about how to get this set up, transferring it from the small rig 8001 to the Peak Design tripod. Now the key here is to unscrew the bowl. After you get that done, you're gonna, there's a bolt on the bottom of the fluid head. You loosen that bolt and it should just come right off. Then you're gonna pop a section off and you have one other screw that you have to loosen. And the funny thing about this is I was watching an Amazon review about this tripod head and small rig actually said that you can't remove it, but you most definitely can and you can mount it to the Peak Design tripod head. Okay, so since I'm gonna be putting this on here, I'm gonna need a way to mount it. And the simplest way to do that is just to have like a Peak Design tripod mount that screws in here. But the problem is you're gonna need an adapter because this is too small for this hole. And so what you're gonna need, which I actually happen to have, is one quarter to three eighths adapter. So this actually just screws in here to make it smaller. So I'm gonna screw this all the way in there. And now this piece here is gonna be able to fit in there. All right, so I got it pretty tight here. I'm just gonna tighten it a little bit more with this Allen wrench. All right, so now that I got this on, I can just mount it right on top of here. Just like that. All right, so let's go ahead and take it out. Now this first shot I took, you can tell it's a little off. I didn't level the tripod. And as you can see, here's the mistake. The horizon is not level. And as you can see in this shot, the problem is fixed just by fixing a simple little mistake. Now, what do you guys think about this tripod head? Is it too big? Is it too small? I mean, I think it's fine. Uh, it's just a little bit on the large size. And a lot of people will say, we'll just get a Ulanzi tripod. You can tilt and you can pan, but it's not a fluid head. And sometimes it's a little better just to have a larger fluid head mounted on these tripods so you get smoother video. Okay, so that was pretty cool. That was, I was not expecting to see the waves that big. They're usually not that big there. So that's kind of why I was sticking around, just taking some photos. But I just wanted to kind of give you a quick overview. So the using the fluid head on the Peak Design tripod is not, it was not as good as I thought it would be. And maybe it's just because of user error. The problem that I had is that the Peak Design plate, since I attached it to the fluid head, it just seemed, like it sometimes was coming off and it was actually like a little wiggly when like I was moving my tripod around, which was really scary. I was really nervous that it was gonna fall and break. Maybe it's just because I didn't tight things down a little bit more and it is kind of hard to tighten it down because it's a fluid head and so it's always turning. The other problem is this is a large fluid head that I'm using and to use this large of a head on this small ball head, it's probably not the best decision. Um, it's pretty massive, and uh, there's a lot other smaller fluid heads that I think would be, would have been a, like a lot better. But I just wanted to try it out. I just wanted to see how it would work because this the, the fluid head in the tripod that I got was eighty dollars. 
total, which was so cheap. I don't even think I can find another tripod head that cheap. So I just wanted to try it out with this Peak Design tripod to see how it works. And I thought that the experience wasn't that bad in general. I think I just need to tighten it down a little bit more next time. But taking this small little tripod out with me, I mean, it's just so light. It's really compact. It's not like carrying around my other tripod, which is massive. I just don't want to draw a lot of attention to me. And when you have a massive tripod like that, um, you're going to definitely get a lot of eyes on you. And just the fact that I had my small Peak Design tripod, I felt like it was a little bit smaller. I could have put it in a backpack, but I just kind of carried it around with me because it's so small and, and light. And it's... The only thing big on it is that massive fluid head. So it would have been nice with a smaller fluid head, but it, I thought it did the job and it was fine for what it could do. All right, so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to know more about the fluid head that I use and the tripod that goes with it, check out my other video here. And like, subscribe. I will see you in the next one. I hope you have a great day.